we're just going to get right into some sun salutation. Just come to the top of the mat. Separate your feet a little bit. Stand really tall. And let your weight rock back just a little bit into your heels. And then press down through your toes. Draw your ribs in, your low belly. Shoulders come back. Just take one deep breath in and exhale. And inhale, take your arms up, look up. And exhale, fold forward over your legs. And inhale, lengthen your spine, half lift, shoulders come back. And exhale, step back into plank. Let's take this one really slow. So hold plank position, arms are straight, legs are straight. Rock forward just a little bit. And then you can drop your knees to keep the legs straight, lower chaturanga. And inhale to upward facing dog, point your toes, open up your chest, and exhale, push back, downward facing dog. A couple deep breaths here, in and out through your nose. And just take one more, breathe in and breathe out. And we'll start to bend your knees, look forward, step or hop forward, lengthen your spine, and fold. Inhale, come all the way up, touch your palms, and exhale, release your hands. And we'll do that again. Inhale, arms lift. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, chaturanga. Step back, lower nice and slow. Inhale, up dog and then exhale push back downward facing dog deep breath in and exhale inhale and exhale and just one more breathe in and breathe out bend your knees look step or hop forward lengthen your spine and fold Inhale to rise, exhale, release your arms. One more time, inhale, exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, chaturanga. Inhale to up dog, and then push back, downward facing dog. Two deep breaths, and breath out. So think of pushing through your palms, turning your triceps down, Think of your forearms drawing towards each other a little bit. Bend your knees, look, step or hop to your hands. Lengthen your spine and fold. Inhale all the way up and then release your arms. Go right into chair pose. So bend your knees, feet are together, take your arms up. And start to look up, drop your shoulders, sit your butt back, draw your low belly in and your ribs. Reach all the way through your fingertips. And exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen your spine. And exhale, step your left foot back, spin your heel down, scoot your right foot to the right a little bit and come into warrior one. Reach up, draw your ribs in, your belly. And exhale, bring your hands down to the floor. Inhale, step that left foot forward, lengthen your spine. And then step the right foot back, spin your heel down, come into warrior one. Breathe in, arms lift. And then exhale, hands to the floor. Step forward, lengthen, and fold. Inhale to chair pose. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, left foot steps back. Inhale, warrior one, arms lift. Exhale, hands to the floor. Inhale, step the left foot forward, lengthen. And exhale, right foot steps back. Inhale, arms lift. Exhale, hands down. Inhale, step forward, top of your mat, lengthen your spine, and fold. Inhale to chair pose. And exhale, fold forward. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale to upward facing dog. And then exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, step your right foot forward, warrior one. And exhale, bring your hands down to the floor. Step back into plank, lower chaturanga. Inhale, open up your chest. And exhale, push back, 
other side. Inhale, left foot forward, warrior one. Exhale, hands down. And then step back, lower chaturanga. Inhale. And exhale. Couple deep breaths. And one more deep breath. Breath out. Bend your knees, look, step or hop, lengthen, and fold. Inhale, chair pose, all the way up, and release your arms. Let's do that one more time, so you're big. Inhale to chair pose, exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway, exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, and exhale. Inhale, right foot steps, take your arms up. Exhale, hands down, step back. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, left foot steps forward. Warrior one. Exhale, hands down. Shut in. Breathe in for up dog and breathe out. Downward facing dog. Good. Inhale, shift forward to plank. Come onto your forearms. Reach back through your heels. Elbows right underneath your shoulders. Think of drawing your forearms in, reaching you know, strongly through your legs. And then let's pivot onto our left side for side forearm plank. Take the right arm up. You can stagger your feet. You can stack. Draw your belly in, your ribs in, firm your thighs. Slowly bring that right arm back down and switch other side. Flex your feet, left arm goes up. Push down into your forearm. And bring that left forearm down, come back into forearm plank. Hold, breathe. Try to open your chest a little bit. Then walk your feet in for dolphin and take the feet wide. Bend your knees a little bit. Push through your forearms and draw the forearms towards each other. Low belly pulls in. Maybe you try to lift one leg, reaching through your toes. And then switch. Other leg, push through your forearms, reach through your toe. And then lower. And you're going to push yourself up onto your hands. Make your way back into downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your right leg straight back. Shift forward, bring your right knee to your elbow. Good. Breathe, hold. Take it over to the left. Hold. Take it back to plank. And then one more time, bring it to center. Place your foot down. And then bring yourself up into a crescent lunge, high lunge. Drop your shoulders a little bit, inner thighs hug towards each other, draw your ribs and your belly in. Deep breaths. Take your arms forward, and then left arm's gonna come underneath for eagle arms. Lift your elbows, inner thighs hug towards each other. Deep breath into your back. Good. Inhale, release your arms. Exhale, bring your hands down and step into standing split into your right foot. You can always bring something underneath your hands, blocks. Turn the left toes down. And exhale, you're gonna cross that left ankle in front of your right, top of your mat. Bend your knees a little bit, squeeze your legs, drop your head. Good, walk your hands forward a little bit and over to the left. Reach with your right hand, your right fingers a lot. And then bring yourself back to center. Lengthen your spine. Uncross your legs. Step back into plank. Drop your heels to the left for side plank. Take your right arm up. You can stagger your feet. You can always drop the knee. Or you can stack. And take that top arm up and over. Squeeze your waist. And exhale, bring your hand down. 
Other side, heels drop to the right. Again, you can always drop your knee, flex your feet. Good, take that top arm up and over. Bring it down, lower chaturanga. Inhale to up dog. And then push back into downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your left leg straight back. Bring your knee to your elbow. Hold, breathe. Take it over to the left, breathe. Right leg's really strong. Take it back to plank. Pull it back to center. Place your foot down. And then bring yourself up into a high lunge. Drop your shoulders. Inner thighs hug towards each other. Draw your low belly in. Deep breath. And then take your arms forward. Right arm's going to go underneath for a little wrap. Lift your elbows. Forearms move forward. Spread your upper back. And inhale, release your arms, bring your hands down, exhale, and then step that right foot forward, cross it over your ankle. Bend your knees a little bit, squeeze your thighs, drop your head. Deep breath. Walk your hands over to the right, reach with your left hand, squeeze the legs together. Bring it back to center. Inhale, lengthen. Uncross your legs. Step back. Plank. Good. Lower chaturanga. Inhale. And exhale. Bend your knees, look forward. Step or hop to your hands. Lengthen your spine. And fold. Inhale to rise. And release. All right, take a big step out to the right. Turn your toes to the back of your mat, and then make your feet pretty wide for warrior two. Keep your hips level, bend your right knee, take your arms straight up. Yeah. So hips aren't tilted at all. Your knees over your heel. Reach a lot through your fingers, but then try to drop your shoulders, draw your ribs and your belly in, and then bring your hands down. Keep your neck soft. Breathe across your chest. Feet draw towards each other a little bit. One more deep breath. And try to keep your thigh really low, reverse warrior. Reach. Good. Bring yourself up straight in your right leg. A little shorter stance for triangle pose. And then really shift your hips, pull that right hip back. Reach forward, land your hand on your shin. Take your left arm up. Good, deep breaths. If you want a little bit more, you can get lighter on your right hand. You could reach that right arm forward, reach the left arm up or take it up and over also. Press through your feet, little bend in that right knee is fine. Reach, turn your ribs up a little bit. Good, and then inhale, bring yourself back up. Bend your right knee, warrior two, and then reach forward for extended side angle. Forearm on your thigh, top arm goes up. Keep your neck soft, try to keep the right shoulder coming down. Steady, smooth breath. Good. Inhale, come up, straighten your right leg. We'll just drop the arms and pivot for warrior two on the left side. So again, hips are level, bend your left knee, open up your arms. Take them up, reach, get really long through the sides of your body. Drop your shoulders, ribs in, belly is in. Back foot turns in just a little bit. And then drop your arms. Now you wanna have your arms in a straight line. Shoulders down a little bit. Feet draw towards each other. Breathe. And one more breath here. And then reverse warrior, inhale. Stretch up through the left arm. Breathe across the sides of your ribs, that left side. And inhale, bring yourself up straight in your left leg. Little shorter stance for triangle. <clears throat> Reach forward. 
I like to have a little bend in my left knee and then I really push down through the heel, the ball of my foot, grip with my toes, reaching, right hip turns down slightly, and bring your hand down, take the right arm up, spread your arms, breathe across your chest, draw your ribs in, and maybe if you want to extend that left arm forward, maybe the right arm reaches too, push through your feet, really use your core, turn your ribs up a little, breathe, Inhale, bring yourself up. All right, drop your arms. Pivot your feet so they're parallel. Bring your hands onto your hips, shoulders back, chest lifts, and then exhale, start to fold. You can drop your hands. If you want, you can always grab for your ankles or your shins, the outsides of your feet, your big toes. Try to open your chest. Another option is you can have blocks under your hands or fingertips. Breathe in and breathe out. And inhale and exhale. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Walk your hands forward, frame that left foot. Step back into plank. And rock forward a little bit so your chest goes forward. Let's do three chaturanga push-ups. Lower halfway, straighten the arm. Lower, straighten, lower, straighten downward dog. Step your right foot forward, drop your back knee, bring your hands onto your thigh, shoulders drop, take your arms straight up. Reach, get really long, and start to curl your back toes and straighten that left leg. Twist to the right, open your arms. And spread your arms, it doesn't matter how deeply you twist. One more, and exhale, bring your hands down to the ground. Left hand's gonna stay down, right arm's gonna go up. And if you want a little bit more, you wanna do a fun transition, drop your left heel to the left, pivot the right foot, flex your left foot, lift your hips, and maybe stack your feet. Breathe. If you want a little bit more, the right arm's gonna go forward, right leg's gonna lift, and then knee to elbow three times. And again. Good, last one. Good. extend, bring your hand down, take a vinyasa, inhale, and exhale. Inhale, step your left foot forward, drop your back knee, bring your hands up onto your thigh. Couple deep breaths here, really stretching the front of that right thigh, hip flexor, quad, arms go up, back toes are curled, and then start to Straighten your leg, lift your knee, really reach back through your heel. Draw your low belly and your ribs in, and then twist to the left, spread your arms. Reach. Good. On your exhale, bring your hands down. Right hand will stay down. You can always scoot the left foot to the left more. Left arm's gonna go up. So nice twist here. Bring that right shoulder back and away from your ear. If you want more, drop the right heel to the right, pivot the left foot, maybe you stack. Good, couple breaths wherever you are. Again, if you want a little bit more, take the left arm forward, lift the left leg, knee to elbow, couple times. Good, pull it in. Last one. Good. Bring your hand down, hold plank. Rock forward a little bit. Three chaturanga push-ups. One, two, three. Downward dog. Bend your knees, look forward, step or hop. Sit down and lay down onto your back. Separate your feet for bridge. So bring your feet um, a little closer together a little more narrow. If the toes touch, that's even fine. And then hands are next to your sides. Inhale, start to lift your hips up. Knees reach forward. And grab hands underneath. Interlace your hands, press your shoulders down. Shift the weight into your right foot. And then just extend the left leg forward. Push down through that right heel. Reach through the left toes. Press through your shoulders. Bring the left foot in. Hips lift. Try not to let your hips shift. Keep them really level as you extend the right leg forward. Breathe. 
Good, bring that leg back in, hips lift up, shoulder push down, and then take the left leg straight up, point your toes, push down through the right heel. Good, lower the left leg, try not to shift the hips, right leg lifts, reach through your toes. Good, lower the right leg, lower your hips. One more time, inhale, hips lift for bridge. Regular bridge, interlace your hands, push your shoulders down, breathe across your chest. Steady, smooth breath. One more, and then release. All right, so we'll do one more back bend. You can do bridge or you could do wheel. Hands will come next to your ears. Then inhale, lift yourself up. Push through your palms, press through your feet. Deep breath. Good, one more. And then tuck your chin, bring yourself down. Let's do one more of those. Um, bridge or wheel. If you haven't done wheel yet, maybe try it out. After doing a few back bends, spine maybe be, maybe a little more flexible. Hands next to your ears. Inhale, take it up. Keep breathing, push through your feet, really strong legs, breathe across your chest. One more breath. And tuck your chin and lower down. All right, so from here, take your legs straight up towards the sky and lower your left leg, bend your right knee. You're gonna lift your chest up fingertips touch underneath your thigh and then just switch either flex or point your toes just keep them active legs are active and switch 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 a few more times and you can always take the arms back legs forward switch a couple times like that inhale exhale Inhale, exhale, good, two more. time lower right lower left lift it lift it and lower all right from here cross your right ankle over your left knee and then bring your hand onto your shin and back your thigh a few deep breaths getting into that right hip Switch sides, cross the left ankle over the right knee. A few deep breaths. And then uncross. Let's wrap ourselves up. Extend your legs and then cross your right foot outside of your left thigh. You can keep the left leg straight or you can bend it back. Just make sure you're sitting on your mat completely. You're not sitting on your heel and you're not leaning to the left. Chest lifts. 
start to turn, try to drop your shoulders, but lift your head, lift your chest, and just breathe deep. And we'll just switch and do the other side. So extend the right leg, cross the left, and then you can keep the right leg straight or bend it back. Right, wrap your arm, you can hook, sit up really tall, and start to turn to the left. And just relax your shoulders down. Try not to lean back, but kind of use that to lift. Breathe. Bring yourself back and cross your leg. Bring the soles of your feet together. Chest lift. Shoulders drop, lean forward. Inhale, bring yourself up and then Last little thing, we'll do a fun little thing. Lean back a little bit, so you're on your sitting bones. Hang on to the big toes, extend your left leg. Extend your right leg. The knees can be bent, that's fine. Drop your shoulders, lift your chest, press your toes into your fingers. Breathe. And start to bring your feet together. Draw your belly in, knees can always be bent. Boat pose, let it go. <clears throat> Deep breath and cross your shins, roll forward, step or hop back, take your vinyasa. Inhale, exhale. Bend your knees, look forward, <clears throat> hop forward, lay down onto your back, extend your legs, open up your arms. <clears throat> so get comfortable any way that feels good. Maybe with a dog, an animal, cuddling. Let your eyes close. Relax your face, your mouth, your shoulders, your stomach. Let your breathing be normal. start to breathe a little deeper. And just make your way up to a seated position. <clears throat> Any way that's comfortable. Bring your hands to your heart. Bow your head down. Lift your head up. Namaste. We have the dogs enter at the end for Shavasana, always. <laughs> 